Oddsmakers gave Wofford a 2.6% chance of beating North Carolina. Guess what happened? North Carolina was a 25-point favorite to beat Wofford on Wednesday night. If you were betting on the money line, you would have had to wager $3,750 to win only $100, which someone apparently did as it implied a 97.4% chance of victory. Spoke with someone earlier tonight who laid $3,750 on UNC to win $100 of free money as they called it. At the real miracle, BeatinTheBookie.com and QIT up, at BeatinTheBookie, December 21, 2017 Oops. Junior guard Fletcher McGee scored a game-high 27 points as the visiting Terriers, 8-4 took a one-point half-time lead and didn't relinquish it in a stunning 79-75 upset of the fifth-ranked Tar Heels. Wofford never trailed in the second half and led by 14 at one point before North Carolina made its charge. The post-game scene in Wofford's locker room was straight out of March, when you beat the number 5 UNC Tar Heels on the road. Pick.twitter.com slash JBCLDHA94K, Wofford Basketball at Wofford MBB, December 21, 2017 Pardon my appearance, soaking wet Terriers coach Mike Young said after the game, according to the app, a little over exuberance from my team. They thought we won the Super Bowl, he continued, per the News and Observer. Maybe we did beating the Tar Heels. Young has been Wofford's coach since 2002, leading the program to its only four NCAA tournament appearances. The last was in 2015. Wednesday's win was the Terriers' second ACC pelt of the season. They scored a 63-60 win over Georgia Tech on December 6, but they had never beaten a team ranked in the top 25 in 22 chances before Wednesday night. North Carolina, 10-2, was coming off a win over Tennessee on Sunday. We got a big win on Sunday and we're fat and happy and think things are just going to be so easy for us. Coach Roy Williams said. He even broke out the potty mouth when talking about North Carolina's six turnovers over the first 12 minutes of the game. You can't turn the daggum basketball over like we did to start the game, Williams said. North Carolina lost a home non-conference game for just the 16th time in 214 games at the Dean E. Smith Center. Read more. Bobby Hurley is leading Arizona State out of the desert on college football signing day. The fax machine finally goes the way of the single wing Julia Louis Dreyfus's son falls 99 points shy of Wilt Chamberlain's record, but poses like him anyway. Georgetown basketball dismisses freshman center over violation of 